Sharing a thought that's still on my mind today. I just did a video recently talking about how the belief system out there in the religious world teaches and preaches about God being ashamed of you and God punishing you and condemning you and they don't say those exact words and sometimes they do though I shouldn't say they don't there is some that do but in the religious realm you you know that that's what they're saying when they're talking about certain stuff and especially if if you leave their church building their facility they tag you as someone going out in the world and and living by their flesh and doing all kinds of awful sin indulging in all kinds of worldly lusts and pleasures those are all the words that are used and I'm still thinking about that today because there's so many young people out there there's a lot of young people that are hurting that are maybe feeling left out and unloved and a lot of people are feeling that they're not accepted and that's true they really don't accept you when you belong to a religious cult until you surrender to their man-made laws to the religious legalism laws then you're more accepting but my thought today is to share that if you're out there today because this is still in my heart to say this I hope you're listening I hope that you can take some time to ask God if he's real and what you mean to him I hope you're out there and I hope that you will take time if you really don't know for sure that there is a God if you really don't know that you're loved and you're accepted and if you're believing all the lies that you learned in in a religious church system I hope that you can take some time to just talk with God right where you're at ask him questions because that's what happened to me there were some things that I saw in the religious cult that my husband and I were involved in and I kept praying and asking God or talking to God and just asking him to reveal himself to me to show me truth to show me himself and he took the blinders off of my heart my mind my eyes and I'm so grateful for that and he's still allowing me to know more about him and I just think that that's the most beautiful thing that you'll ever want to know or learn about or be with he's the most beautiful thing or person Yes, you still go through a lot of things in this world because we live in this world. But this is not where we're going to dwell forever. So today I'm just 
thinking about young people and hurting people and there's so much so much people that have left those buildings are trying to commit suicide on drugs prostitution doing all kinds of things and I've actually talked to some and they believe that God is ashamed of them they believe that they're in trouble with God and they're being punished and they believe that they could never come back to God because he's disgusted with them they feel that because they left the religious legalism cults of churches out there that they could never come to God until they go back to one of those decorated facilities that's what they believe they learned that in those decorated facilities they've learned that do I believe it's too late for them no I don't but there might be someone who's out there listening to this right now and I just want you to know that there is a God and he's real and he wants you to know how much you're loved but that has to come from him and he's merciful and he's not ashamed of you he's not punishing you so that's my thought today to be continued with more thoughts in Jesus name <laughs>